sir now i will explain what is the need of properties file or what is the need of properties concept first assume that i have one small java program is there sir assume assume that this is the java program what i have in this program assume connection con is equal to yes can you please guide how to get connection object driver manager dot get connection driver manager dot get connection get connection of sir jdbc colon uh, can you please guide if it is the type 4 driver of oracle jdbc colon oracle colon uh, jdbc colon oracle colon thin colon at the rate local host colon 1521 colon xe are you getting sir this is jdbc url okay comma comma what is the next one sir username scott comma what is the next one sir password what is the password sir tiger do you know username scott under then password is the tiger now i got the connection object once i got the connection object happily do you know we can use that connection and communicated with the and i can get the data from the database right sir this is the small java program what we have assume assume that this total thing is the program right now take a bit very very special care so do you know in this program in this program jdbc url username and the password these things uh, may change frequently correct or not do you know according to client requirement according to client client requirement compulsory we require to change the database username and password for every six months regarding for every six months but due to to meet security constraints so even in our bank atm pin numbers next and after that login password compulsory we require to change for every six months it's a recommendation from the bank sir but very unfortunate once you got atm card once the initial pin number whatever provided by bank people that is the only pin number we are always using even for years of time are you getting it's a never 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 recommended sir okay so once you got atm card okay pin number once you got default pin number from the bank highly recommended to change that next for every every six months compulsory we require to change are you getting because to meet security concern same way in the sir between software company and the client there are some sles will be there service level agreements are you getting that what is that service level agreements will be there sir in the sles compulsory one phrase by default will be there for every three months or for every six months all credentials must require to be changed are you getting that okay sir because the reason is to meet security concern compulsory we require to change sir sir now this is my java program in this java program there are some some variable things are there one is jdbc url second one is username and the third one is one password so in our program if anything which it changes frequently are you getting that jdbc url username and password which it changes frequently never recommended to hard code sir like this are you getting if any person is writing java program in this style give left and right because it is not a good programming practice it is not industry standard approach are you getting right so what mistake i'm doing sir because sir the only mistake what you did is we are hard coding database username database password jdbc url are you getting that we are hard coding this you know password will change for every three months or six months Usernames and password may change. Are you getting? So, if anything which changes frequently, never recommended to hard code in our Java program. Never recommended to place like this. Hard coding, sir. Never recommended to hard code like this. Then immediately ask, sir. If I hard code, because in all my previous programs, I hard coded only. In all my previous programs, I hard coded like this. Sir, what is the problem with that? You may ask. Very simple, sir. Tomorrow password got changed password got changed if you want to reflect that change in dot java file sir in the java source code source code some change is there some change is there maybe tiger replacer with the tiger one two three assume password got changed sir in the java program if any change is there even small change also 
Kama, Kama replaced with semicolon. <laughs> Are you getting Kama replaced with semicolon? Even for this change also, how many activities we have to do, sir? Compulsory. We have to recompile. Sir, without compilation, without compilation, there is no chance at all. It won't be, it won't reflect that change. That change we require to recompile. Sir, if it is the web application, we have to rebuild the application. Creation of where file, creation of year file is called build, build process, right? We require to rebuild the web application, right? Sir, next, we require to redeploy, redeploy the application to reflect that change. Are you getting? So, we require to recompile, rebuild application, redeploy. And sometimes, uh, server restart also must be required. Server restart, server restart also must be required. Make sure, sir, you people should be aware. So, even if you change a small change also, something like comma replaced with semicolon, even for this small change also, compulsory, what we require to do is, we have to recompile, we have to rebuild, we have to redeploy, and sometimes server restart also required. Then only the change will be reflected. Clear, right? So, to perform any change, compulsory we require to do all these activities. Then automatically, is it a bigger problem or not? There is a big business impact to the client. Remember, for every six months, if I require to change the password, for every six months, this application will be down for one or two hours to do all these activities. If the application is down, for one or two hours, there is a big business impact to the client. Remember that? Suppose ICIC bank, ICIC servers are there. If ICIC servers are down for two minutes, down for two minutes, minimum two crores lost to the ICIC bank. Remember that, sir. So server time is the very crucial. Applications are always up and running 24 by 7. Remember that. So if you, if you for every six months, because username got changed or password got changed, not uh, to reflect that change, I have to recompile, rebuild and redeploy and restart the server unnecessary. Big business impact to the client. Clear for all of it? So in our Java program, if anything which changes frequently, like usernames, password, JDBC URL, such a type of things uh, never recommended, never recommended to hard code in our Java program. I hope everyone can able to understand, right? Then immediately we ask, sir, if you are not going to hard code, how you can, how you can solve this problem? Very simple, sir. We can solve this problem by using the most powerful concept, properties file. Are you getting that? We can solve this problem by using the most powerful concept. What is that concept, sir? Properties. Okay, clear? So, how you can solve this problem, sir? Very simple. Let me explain orally. Let me, let me explain orally and then I will go for coding level. Just uh, have a look once, right? Sir, assume that, assume this is my Java program. Assume that this is the Java program, Java source code, sir. Java program dot Java file. Okay, dot Java file. Sir, here, if anything which changes frequently, never recommended to place in the Java program. What is the problem with that? Sir, do you know, if any change is there in the Java program, to reflect that change, I have to recompile, rebuild, redeploy, server restart also must be required. Unnecessary performance issues are going to come in the picture. So, it's a big business impact to the client. Clear, right? Sir, now, what I will do is, such a type of variable things, you can, you can keep, you can configure in the properties file. Regarding, you can configure in the properties file, sir. Sir, assume db db dot properties what is this one sir can i can I spell out db dot properties okay now jdbc url is equal to jdbc url is equal to sir have you observed jdbc colon oracle colon dot 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 of course complete url i'm going to write next uh, user is equal to scott next uh, password is equal to tiger so, which things are going to change frequently, such type of things, uh, I will configure in the, in the properties file. Sir, immediately ask the question, sir, what is that properties, what is the extension, is it mandatory or not? Recommended, recommended to use that properties, if you want you can use uh, db.txt also. 
db.txt also if you want you can use db.durga also are you getting because in java file extension is not important you can take anything no problem at all clear for all of you sir what is the advantage advantage sir now configure such type of thing in our properties file clear right sir from java program from java program we can read these properties we can read these properties and we can use these properties are you getting from java program we can read the properties which are configured in the properties file and we can use those properties in our java program but how to read out to you that part i will take care sir sir now immediately mask so instead of hard coding you are taking those inside properties file inside properties file what is the advantage of this approach sir very simple tomorrow password got changed are you getting tomorrow password got changed where we require to perform this change we require to perform this change inside properties file are you getting tomorrow password got changed where we require to perform this change inside properties file suppose password instead of tiger i'm taking tiger 1 2 3 okay automatically this change will be reflected to java program sir if we are not required to compile if it is a stand alone application automatically this change by default will be reflected to java program we are not required to compile if it is a web application web application we are not required to do all these activities recompile rebuild and so on just we required to do redeploy the application are getting just we required to do redeploy the application automatically the changes will be reflected there is no big business impact to the client clear for all of it so in our java program if anything which changes frequently never never recommended to hard code those things in our java program where we have to configure configure those inside properties file and read those properties from java program and use those properties right the biggest advantage of this approach is if tomorrow if there is any change in the properties if there is any change in the properties sir then to reflect that change we are not required to do anything sir because i didn't perform that change inside java source code i performed that change where sir inside properties file everyone can able to understand so modifications enhancements will become very very easy without affecting java program happily you can perform any type of changes because of this properties file clear right the most valuable important concept in real time itself is the properties file compulsory you people should have clear clear clarity sir so how to read how to use that part i will take care don't worry about that just first get the basic idea clear right okay sir let me show up to this whatever theory i covered so that you people can get much clarity have a look one have a look once what is our concept sir properties what is the concept of properties so in java program if anything which changes frequently like jdbc url username and password etc are not recommended to hard code in our program sir the problem in this approach is if there is any change in the java program to reflect that change we have to recompile rebuild and redeploy total application even sometime server restart also required which creates big business impact to the client are getting that if there is any change in the java program if there is any change in the java program to reflect that change we have to recompile rebuild and redeploy the total application and even sometimes server restart also required okay to overcome this problem we should go for what properties file remember that to overcome this problem we should go for properties file the variable things uh, we have to configure in the properties file and we have to read those properties from java program okay now the main advantage of this approach is if there is any change in the properties file under to reflect that change just a redeployment is enough which won't create any business impact to the client everyone can able to understand right so what is the advantage of properties file okay variable things we require to configure in the properties file from java program happily you can use clear up to this sir if you feel comfortable up to that now i will go for how to write code for the properties okay is it clear right okay that's it.